welcome back to my channel if you are seeing this face for the first time my name is joy and i'm a nursing student in nigeria delta state so guys um i don't know if you've watched the part one of how i was scammed in nursing school and how i saved my friend so this is going to be the part two make sure you watch from that one so that you are going to know where I started from. So this is just the continuation. So let's just dive right to it. And make sure you subscribe to this video. In my last video, I was talking about... Um, I stopped in where um, my mom went to the shop to relax. Yes, guys. So my mom went to the shop to relax. And then um, she, she met a man and a woman there. So she said she should just talk. Like... I believe that was the Holy Spirit telling her, just talk. Um, so, do you know if the school has started selling their form? So the guy said, no. <laughs> like, seriously, the guy said, no. That they've not started selling the form. And mind you, we've already paid the money for the form. So my mom was like, you've not started, you have not started selling the form. And the guy said, yes. <laughs> guys follow me so my mom was like um we checked online okay i was i was with my mom then but my dad was in the car so my mom said enjoy go and call your daddy so i went and i called my dad and he came so my dad came and um she told my dad that they've not started selling the form yet so my dad now said um we checked online the previous day and we saw this number of one doctor they will write it doctor something so we saw the number of this doctor and um, the doctor gave us the number of this mrs rosemary dr mrs rosemary so we were explaining to the guy that we met at the cafe so the guy was like no it's not true that the state school of nursing form is not out and that was march that we went that, that we were scammed march of 2019 that was when the scam happened so they were not like we should drive into the school then we'll meet the principal of the school and when we meet the principal of the school we should ask him about the school you get we should ask him and then um, he was like that's how it is done that there's no much information about state about school of nursing online that you have to go to the school and get your information so we we're like okay so the guy was telling us that um previous years that they scam people that people will buy from all the way from different states in nigeria that people will buy from from far and then um, you know they will buy from from like lagos another state this is this the school of nursing is, is in abuja Babalada. and people will pay for form they will check online people will check and buy form from different states they will even these scammers they will even come come to the point where they will tell you pay for accommodation fee and you will pay for accommodation fee because you'll be giving you'll be giving a false um admission letter and guys it will be stamped this false admission letter it will be stamped that is from the school please please guys don't fall for it I didn't reach the extent of them giving me um, admission letter, but my friend who I saved, she got to the extent. She got to the extent. I'm going to tell you her story also in this video. Yes, yes, guys. So that was what happened. So let me also tell you guys about my friend's own. Let me just brief it. So we were in a group chat. We were yeah, my church group chat. So my church, there's this association in my church called Altar Girls. I was, the, I, I was the president because I'm no more their president since I've gone to school. So um, they, you know, they told me that uh, we, we were in this group chat and the girl was like, 
um, please help me thank God. That was what she said. She said, please help me thank God. And we were like, thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> you know, you know, we we're thanking God. So I, I private chatted this girl and I was like, um, I don't want to say her name, but I was like, um, what are you thanking God for? You know, and she said she has gotten admission into school of nursing, Guagualada. And this was in 2020. Yeah, it was in 2020. And let me say something. After writing that 2019 exam, I'm saying. So, um, she, I asked her, what are you thanking God for? And she said she, she has, gotten admission, has gotten admission into school of nursing, Guagualada. So, I was like wow thank god are you serious congratulations she sent the um admission she sent the admission um admission letter yes she sent the admission letter to me that they've given her admission they wrote her name on the admission paper they stamped it and they signed on top of it and i and i was like sorry you don't be offended Please, when did you people buy the form? When did you guys wrote the exam? Because this was during Corona period. I don't, I don't, I don't know, coronavirus period. This was during coronavirus period. So I was like, when did you people buy the form? When did you guys sit for the exam? When did they call you guys for interview? And when did they give you admission? <laughs> so I was asking all this question and she was like um, she bought the form this was so time and she bought the form this was so time and um, um, the person just did an underground interview she's kind she's that and, I, um, and me I was like okay if I get to if I get home because when she was telling me that I was not at home so I was like, if I get home, I'm going to tell my dad to call those people we met in the cafe and make inquiry. And also, he should call the secretary of the school. So I was like, are you sure? She said, yes. I said, okay, we have the secretary's number of the school. And we also have the um, some people's number in the school. So that evening, I came home and... Um, I told my dad about it and I told my dad to call the um, secretary of the school. So he called the secretary of the school and he asked the secretary if they started selling the form. And the man said no, that they've not started selling the form. That the form is, and, and the, in 2020, this was around, this was around um, July. He said because of the coronavirus, they can't start selling the form now and all of that. So when my dad told me that thing, I was like, are you sure? He said yes, that he can also call those people we met in the cafe. So he also called them. And after calling them, they said the same thing like the, the thing the principal said. And now I was faced with trying to convince this girl that the form is not out yet. So I was chatting with her and I was telling her, please don't pay any money. The form is not out yet. I've spoken to my dad. My dad has spoken to the secretary and, this, and he has also spoken to some other people in the cafe, you know. So this girl was saying that it's a lie because she has gotten to that extent where they gave her admission later. And they were telling her to pay money for accommodation. You get so i was trying to convince her as a good friend telling her no it's not out these people are trying to scam you i've been scammed and all of that i was telling her and she was like it's not true i said okay please please let me speak to your dad so that's what i told her i said please let me speak to your dad and she was like no you can't speak to my dad because he told me not to tell anyone um, because uh, till when I entered the school, <laughs> you know Nigeria now, you know myself and yourself, you know how it is done. When you tell someone <laughs> to be like a, <clears throat> but you understand, let me not go for that, but you understand, yes guys. So it will be like, you know, <clears throat> so I was begging, I 
was I was at this point I was begging because I I was not comfortable coming from somewhere that she's coming from you get so I was begging her I was like let me speak to your dad so finally she agreed and I am my elder sister we spoke to the dad we told him that we were scammed before and all of that that is a scam that they should not pay more money to the place so he later agreed and I sent the secretary's number to my friend so my friend called my friend called the secretary number and he the man paid and she told the man that she has bought form and the man told her it's 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 not from them okay it's not from them and she was like okay and all of that so she was thanking me later that joy thank you so much that thank you so much that you didn't you convinced me you didn't allow me to pay and all of that so guys that's how it went so there are there are other parts attached to this story but i don't want us to go too far this video is already long it's long already so before i end this video i would like to just say a few things um one thing is that if those scammers are coming they will not give you they will give you an individual account okay the name on the account will be an individual account it's not going to be a group account but school of nursing you will see the name of the account the the account name in school of nursing abuja, abuja is fct school of nursing abuja make sure guys that it is the correct name of the school some scammers will even go ahead and use the same name as the school there'll be a very slight difference i'm telling you guys there'll be a very slight difference in the name you get so make sure and most school of nursing in nigeria their detail are not online okay their detail are not online you have to go to the school majority of those school of nursing you know school of nursing is not really like um the university where you can see much information online no that's not how the school of nursing is the school of nursing system does not work like that yes guys so you have to go to the school to confirm if you're paying money it has to be the 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 the, the, the name of the account has to be the direct like the main school of nursing account yes and the account number should be given to you directly from the school that's how things are done please guys share this video to as much people you know please so that people will not be scammed is these hard times you can, money is not easy to get this time so please share this video to many people that you think is going to be helpful to please do well to share it so thank you so much guys for watching make sure to share this video guys if you like this video make sure to like make sure to call uh, just leave your comments down below of what you think leave your comments if you've been scammed before leave your comment telling us how you've been scammed let's continue the gist in the comment section and i'll do well to reply all the comments i see thank you so much guys leave your experience down below i love you guys take care of yourself and by the grace of god i'll see you in my next video thank you <laughs>